guys, it is Wednesday. It is April 27th, and I just got done with the car wash. My hair is in a little bun, y'all. I'm wearing a bun for the next three weeks until my wedding. I'm trying to tell y'all. It is um, Wednesday. I just got done with the car wash. I just cleaned and back in my car. And then now I'm about to go get me something to eat. I am going out for a quick lunch. This time probably by myself. I'm not really like going with anybody. I'm sorry, so sad that like I have like some sinuses. Like my eyes are always puffy, but like they're like OD puffy and like I'm all like congested and snotty. So excuse me for sounding so terrible, but uh, it's just so annoying. But anyways, um, I'm about to head out to get some pizza I really want some pizza and then I'm gonna head to Target um, on the way back and then go home because I really don't have anything else to do today um, I'm kind of tired I just wanted to get out the house to like make myself feel better because I stayed in the house all day yesterday so yeah let's just go and get to the restaurant all right I made it to the pizza place y'all I'm at Cosmos let me turn it around I'm at Cosmos Pizza and Social out in um, Longville. This reminds me of a place back home, like up north. I love coming to places like this. I got me my little ginger ale on the side. I love having me my ginger ale and a cup on the side. And, um, ooh, they got all my little things on it. That's great. Where's the cheese? Uh -huh. Okay, gotta have the cheese now. I have a little Italian market too, cute. And then they have another side over there that's like a bar. So I am um, just waiting for my pizza and then I'll probably eat like half of it. I don't ever finish my food. Um, I got a personal. And then I'm gonna go to Target. Hopefully this music doesn't get copyrighted because I'm always getting copyrighted. But yeah, but I don't know. Hopefully it doesn't. Pizza's here, you guys. Oh my gosh, it is so bad. Like, it is so good. Mm. Yes. Okay, guys, so I literally stopped on my way from eating pizza. I left the um, pizza shop. I feel, I sound so bad, but like I said, I'm kind of sick, but um like sinuses or whatever but i left the pizza shop can you see me it's a lot of sun but i'm not trying to get too much sun i don't know i left the pizza shop y'all i dogged that pizza <laughs> it was so good i'm not even gonna lie i don't know if you guys are out in lawrenceville or been in lawrenceville or whatever but i love lawrenceville like i love the city but i kind of outgrew the city just a little bit because i like going there for certain reasons but to live there i don't know like my kids are older and then Macy's four, so like she's growing up. I don't want her in the city. Like when we had our apartment in the city, it was just a lot going on. Like it was a lot of hot mess going around that they were watching and witnessing. So I was like, yeah, nah, I need to move far. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, anyways, um, living like 40 minutes, you know, outside the city, I don't mind. But I just stopped in Lawrenceville it has some pizza and then I am at this park by myself. It's so funny because people are bringing like their kids and my kid is at school. <laughs> but um, yeah, some days I'll let her skip school but most days like I literally like to be by myself, enjoy those times. I say this all the time but we don't have family out here like that. So the time that she gets in school is valuable to me because I like to, you know, spend time you know give mommy time I was watching TikTok about mom guilt and it was like why do we pick our kids up so early like why do we just go and pick our kids up so early some kids don't want to be at school all day Macy's definitely not in school all day I tell y'all all the time she is like one of the last kids to be dropped off because I just don't think she need to be there six to six like that's crazy she gets dropped off like 10 and gets picked up by 5 by 30 um but I was just like, you know, listen to the mom on TikTok when she was like, why do you have such mom guilt? Like, you know, do your errands. Like, do what you gotta do. You don't have to run and go get your kid. And I was just like, that is so true. 
I agree. I know some moms would be like, well, I miss my baby, so I gotta go get them, and that's fine. Oh, sorry, it's a little windy. It's a nice breeze. Sorry if it's, like, windy, but, you know, I don't mind keeping her in there just a little bit longer. Um, because you, you need all the energy you can get, especially when you don't have a support. You need all the energy you can get. Like, seriously, don't feel bad. Soaking up the sun, y'all. Loving it. Um, I'm about to head to Target, though, before it gets too late. And I'll see y'all guys there. All right, y'all. Stuff this on probably to get some flowers. I got these. It's three for 12. So I don't know if I should get something else. Guys, I'm looking at these reefs. I love how big this one is. If I can get it off the hook. I have this one, which is kind of cute. It's only $25. My reef from Target that I currently have was literally 50 bucks or something like that. It's so expensive. This one is only $16.99. They have this light one and then they have this one. I don't know what I'm trying to get. Babe has been complaining about our reef. Saying that it's old and we need a new reef, there's no color. So should I do this one? Or should I do this one? Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh my gosh, look at this guys. $79.99, but look how beautiful and tall this is. Oh, they got a black one too? That looks so pretty. Oh y'all, I'm in Target. Look at these sandals. Oh my gosh, they're so freaking cute. I like this color better. Like, oh my gosh, against my skin. Oh my gosh, I'm loving this color better. They're only $25. Like, what? I'm gonna get these. I'm seeing like red, white, and blue, and I'm like, what is red, red, red white? And blue but it's memorial day like i could forgot all about memorial day like sorry i wasn't paying attention target's home door started to stink <laughs> it's starting to look a little funky a little like what's going on it's just not given i mean i like these little vases of course but other than that, it's nothing to look at. All the pool stuff. This is so cute. I cannot wait to get Macy a little pool towel. This one's cute. It's only six dollars. So freaking cute beach towel. I feel like the weather's not quite there yet for full-on um, sprinkler, but we'll be there very soon. I actually can't wait to get Macy a pool, like have a little pool out there. I can't wait. But I think I'm done in Target. They really ain't talking about nothing <laughs> for once. So I'm gonna um, get the last bit of stuff and then go home. Okay guys, I'm finally back home. It is 8.14. It doesn't look like it's eight o'clock because it's so light out, but it's 8.14. 8.14. Um, I'm about to, <laughs> rude, that's babe leaving the house, but, um, I want to show you guys what I got from TJ Maxx real quick in Target, and I'm going to relax because I'm tired and my voice is going, like, I don't know what this is. First thing I want to share with you guys is my wreath. So cute. I love how green it is, and with this black tie, it just looks so freaking, like, modern. $24.99. When I was checking out, the lady was like, I could get a letter. <coughs> I can get a letter from like Michael's or Joann's or something like that. Or Hobby Lobby. And I like these craft wooden letters. And I can put that right here. Just to spruce it up because it is a plain wreath. I like the plainness, but you know, she did put the idea in my head. And like, we all have the same last name soon. Or we're all gonna have like the same last name. So it could be like our family thing right here. So, super cute, TJ Maxx. The next thing I got is some candles. I got two of these candles. 
my absolute favorite candles. These are the w DW Home Clean Kitchen Candles. Oh gosh. These smell so good. Lemon, I don't know, it's so good. I had to buy two of them. I brought two of them. They were um, $7.99 because they're the smaller ones. So yeah, I had to get two. I'll show you where the other one is at real quick. So this is where the other one is at, right here. And these are my flowers, so pretty. These were $8 all together. These were $8, my ghetto tripod, because <laughs> I don't feel like going upstairs. But um, the yellow roses and then the baby breaths, so cute. And then there's the other clean kitchen candle. The last thing I got from TJ Maxx is, this was random. I got this while I was standing in line to check out. It is this orange blossom hand wash and lotion. This was only $7.99. It came, it comes with this little like case. This smells so good. Like so freaking good. Let me smell. Oh yeah, it smells like oranges, like juicy oranges. Okay, so Target was really, really, really random. Most of the stuff that I got from Target was like household things that I don't care about. Like, um, you know, I got from Target like mop pads, um, detergent, stuff like that. But the one thing I got that I showed you guys are these super cute slides. Huh? Macy. The super cute slides, like super cute. I got them in a the size six. I normally wear a seven, but I feel like these are big. Like, how big they are. These were big, so they fit me perfectly. I just think these are so cute. I had to get this color. Like, this color was calling me, so I absolutely love them. They look so cute. So, that's all for today. I think I'm gonna take a bath. Um, Soaking some Epsom salt and stuff, and I just really soothe my body. I haven't took a bath in such a long time. But yeah, guys, I'm about to go relax, so I'll see ya tomorrow. Hey guys, it's Saturday. I sound crazy, which is why I haven't been filming. But I think the last time I filmed was like, when's the last time I filmed? I think it was like Wednesday. Thursday I didn't film because my sinuses were terrible. Like they were really, really bad. Yesterday was Friday. I went out and ran some errands. I went to um, Linux Mall and stuff and I didn't feel like taking my camera out because I was running around and y'all know how I feel about filming inside of um, Linux and like Fips or whatever. I just feel like that's so weird to do. So I didn't take y'all with me. <clears throat> My camera was dead and I didn't feel like charge, I mean, bringing batteries, so I just left it here. So, today is Saturday, last day of the vlog. I sound so bad. <clears throat> I'm so sorry. I look, I look crazy and I'm like stuffed up. Like, these sinuses are really getting to me. Um, when it comes to the spring, I love it, but at the same time, this is the part that I hate when it's like really bothering me. I took medicine and I've been taking medicine, but it's just like, ugh, it's like mucus and stuffiness and congestion and it's just a hot mess. And like my throat doesn't hurt anymore, but I have, I've been drinking tea and stuff and it's just like, I just sound sick, but whatever. <sighs> so, um, yeah, that's what's been going on with me. How's y'all week been? Um, how's y'all weekend? Let me put y'all my tripod real quick. Okay, so today I wanted to do the patio out like in the front. Um, I didn't really buy anything new other than that reef from TJ Maxx that I showed you guys, but I didn't really buy anything new because I feel like I already have like some stuff to work with for their outdoor area plus um, I'm not trying to buy a lot of home stuff right now at this moment. I think I'm just gonna start getting decorated outside, at least change the reef and stuff and doormat and then see what else I wanna 
put out there. I'm gonna try to get through the rest of the vlog without sounding like a frog, but it's just so hard. Anyway, so I'm gonna show you guys um, my bridal shower haul because I told you guys I had a lot of stuff for my bridal shower. I'm so excited. So I'm gonna share with you guys what I got. I got this big old box. Y'all see this box? Oh my God. Okay, let me put it on the floor. <laughs> big old box. Ugh. It's heavy. Oh my God, okay. In a big old box. So, I'm just gonna pick through the box and show you guys what I got. So, this first thing is this acrylic sign and stand. It says, favors, please take one. I thought this was so cute. Comes with like a little stand. It's acrylic. Y'all know I love like simple, cute, aesthetic stuff. So this is one thing that I got to put on the table because I did get, um, what is that called? Bridal shower favors. This big old box, I got some plastic cutlery. It says it serves 50 guests. I freaking, I freaking, freaking love these things, okay? Because look at how they look. They are so freaking aesthetically cute. They're like really cute. I just love how they look. They are forks and knives and spoons. They're gold. I think they look so cute. Like look. They're plastic. I don't know, it's not folks. Okay, yeah, see, they're plastic, cute. So cute, like they're plastic, but they don't look plastic, if that makes sense. Like they look, they look um expensive. <laughs> These are the spoons, super cute. So I got that all on Amazon, serves 50, so it should be enough. And then in this box, oops, heavy, oh my gosh, oof. My fiance was like, I thought this was glass, and it looks like glass, like the um, the cutlery and the plates, he thought that they were glass, and I'm like, I know, they don't look like it. But this is 30 pieces of white dinner plates and 30 pieces of white dessert plates. And they are white, all white. They look so nice, so look at how they look. Like, this is the bigger one. These are plastic too, plastic, look. So cute, like, it doesn't look plastic, it looks glass. And then this is the um, de uh, dessert plate. The dessert plate and then the dinner plate. Goes like that, so freaking cute. They are not glass, plastic. So, you know, I love this. I'm about to start buying my dinnerware from um, Amazon. <laughs> because they could look like this and be cute. I'm all for it. All right, I got some napkins. I got some napkins. These are um, some napkins that I picked out. This is what they look like. From Miss to Mrs. I just wanted something cute and simple. And I thought this was really cute to cross off the Miss and put Mrs. Like that, I think that's real cute. They're white with the gold foil. So I got some of these, these are, 50, 50 pieces, I will link everything because literally everything came from Amazon, so I will link it. That's those, and then I got another set of napkins, but this time I just got these brown craft ones that have like a little design. I honestly, um, these are 100 packs, so they're 100 packs of these brown craft napkins. Um, just to layer with the white and gold ones. You guys, I don't know if I told you this, but my bridal is a boho theme, so that's why everything is like neutrally colored. <laughs> like, it's me we're talking about, what else did I want? Like, yeah, no, I don't be going all the way with stuff. Like, that's not me. So I wanted something boho and, you know, cute and elegant, so that's what I'm going for. So that's why everything's 
pretty much neutral. Speaking of boho theme, I got these, um, what are these called? These pompous grass, they are 80 pieces. Yeah, they're 80 pieces of 17 inch boho, I'm boho, pompous grass. So, they have all different kind of colors. It's um, white, brown, this greenish color, like all kinds of colors. I still have this wrapped in the um, plastic because I'm not gonna take it out yet until it's closer to the time. These are centerpieces, these are decor, so the pumpus grass is going to go on the tables and the vases. So this is the centerpieces. Lastly, what's in this box is two bags of these tissue paper pom-pom kits, which I didn't realize it was a lot. I already had this one open. I didn't realize it was this many. Like, I didn't realize there was that many in here. But they are neutral colors. So you have like the cream one. Let me show you guys, take it out. It's a cream one, it's a blush pink one. Yeah, you have this mauvey pink one, this ivory one, this champagne one, I guess, and then this brown gold one. So all of them, which is so funny because literally, <coughs> these four colors are the colors of our wedding. Exact colors of our wedding. So that is what they come with. There's all different sizes, like all different sizes. How many pieces comes with this? It didn't say. Oh yeah. It's 20 pieces. I don't know why I got two of these. I don't know why I got two packs. But I fluffed one out and this is what it looks like. So there are these beautiful like pom pom neutral floral things that I'm gonna put on the table as well as centerpieces. So I thought that was really cute. Um, it did take me a little while to like fluff them out. What didn't take me a long time, but to do 40 of these is gonna take a minute. So my sister-in-law should be here to help me out and my sister should also be here the week of to help me out. My sister lives here already in Atlanta, but um, my sister-in-law doesn't, but she's not far, so. Should be here to help me out, because I'm gonna need help doing all of these, because I may not even open up this pack. I might just send this one back, because that's a lot. I didn't even realize it was that much. So that's all I got currently for the bridal shower. The only thing else that I need to get, the thing that I would need to get for the bridal shower is, um trays, serving trays. So like, um, I already have a jacuzzi board that I'm gonna use of my own to put out there. But I'm also gonna need like gold plastic trays to put like the food on, cause I don't wanna put it in aluminum foil. Um, so I'm just gonna get like gold or acrylic trays, which I already have, I'm bugging. Like I already have some of those. Let me show y'all. So I do have these from my birthday, like this past year. Um, these are dirty, I need to clean them, but um, I do have these that I can use for like the table setting and then get some gold ones for like the desserts, like the um, towers and stuff, because I want to have like macarons, cupcakes, like little things like that that I can put um, on the tower. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna use for like the food. All right, so I told you guys I went to Linux Mall yesterday. So I got a couple of things. Um, the first thing I got is I went to Sephora. I only got two things from Sephora, but I'm, I'm really excited about them. I got the Mario Podescu, Podescu, Podescu um, facial spray with the rose water. This is the one I get. It's, a, it's only like $5, so I got the small one. You know how they have like little grabs at the checkout. So I got that. I have not been going to Sephora to shop for makeup or anything like that because I'm trying to like clear my face up. And the skincare that they offer, I don't really like wear from Sephora. So I really don't go to Sephora like that to buy stuff because I'm, you know, I just don't wear makeup like that anymore. But um, 
I love the rose water. And then this thing right here is something that I absolutely wanted to try. It is the Tom Ford Soleil or Soil Blanc, Soil Blanc Shimmering Body Oil. This is a TikTok splurge, literally a TikTok splurge because I just been seeing this all around TikTok and I've been seeing people getting it. I got the mini one because I got the mini one because like, you know, I don't know if it's gonna work good on me. It looks good on other people, but I don't know if it's gonna look good on me. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. I don't know if I'm gonna have a reaction. I don't know. So I always get the mini just in case my receipt was emailed to me. Cause I ain't got time to be looking for no receipt. So yeah, I just got these two from Sephora yesterday. Definitely something that I wanna try. Well, the rose water I always try, but Tom Ford body oil, yes. And then, surprisingly, I went to Forever 21. I do not shop at Forever 21. Ben stopped shopping at Forever 21, like, years ago. I recently heard that they had a Herb Ledger um, collab, and I've been seeing it all over TikTok. This is another TikTok. I guess this part can be TikTok, because I literally did not know about none of these things until I saw it on TikTok. But I heard about their collab and I was like, I gotta try that. I gotta go and try it. Ended up going in there and finding this dress. Look at the color, look at the color. Like, look at the color. So freaking cute. Let me show y'all. It's her ledger in Forever 21. This dress retails at it was $69.99, I got it in a small. Okay guys, this is how the dress looks on me. It's by Herb Ledger um, in Forever 21. It's still not fully zipped because I'm trying, but I can't. Oh, I got it. Okay, I got it. All right, <laughs> zipped it up. I had to get this dress when I tried it on. I just thought it was so freaking cute and it just hugs my body right. It just makes everything look so good. So yeah, I just love it. It's super like clenchy, like a, what is it? Like a, what do you call these type of body con? It's super body con, <clears throat> like super, super body con. I'm trying to push it down. Super body con. I cannot wait to put like some heels. Okay. Period. Some nice heels on. Dinner, a nice clutch. So freaking cute. So Forever 21, her ledger collab, $70. Period. Love this. The last thing I went to go get from Lennox is kind of part of my luxury haul. But I'm just gonna give you guys a sneak peek like I've been doing. Literally guys, I'm waiting for one item to come um, in order for me to fill my luxury haul. I need one more item because I had to purchase this item that um, I'm waiting on and the delivery was delayed. The delivery was delayed and I just got an email today saying it's been shipped. So hopefully it gets here next week so that I can film for you guys. So the luxury haul will be coming next week so stay tuned make sure you have your bells on for the notification of when my luxury haul my first ever luxury haul will be live i want you guys to like literally tune in because this is going to be something different for me and i think it's going to be fun i'm going to make it fun and i just like want you guys to tune in to see something different Cartier, baby, Cartier. Um, so yeah, I got something from Cartier. Spoiler alert, it is my ring. And I have been obsessing over this ring for a minute because it's not like all the other rings that I've been seeing from Cartier. I probably won't be able to show you guys the actual product, but all the unboxing and everything that comes with it because I think Cartier's packaging is pristine. Hands down, they give you so much stuff. Like, they give you just, it's just, I love it. Um, them Chanel favorites. So, um, oh, and Dior. Dior has um, 
great packaging too. But um, yeah, I'm going to go outside and start to like spruce out that out there to get the front door um, going. All right, I'm outside and I have everything out here. I literally pulled everything from my um, garage <laughs> because I have a lot of stuff still and I didn't want to like, you know, buy anything new unless I have to. I went to Walmart and I did not find um, the wooden letter, letter that I was looking for. That bird scared me. I didn't find the wooden letter that I was looking for, but that's okay because I'll probably just go to Michael's or Joanne's and find it there. Um, so yeah, I didn't get to find it. I didn't get to get the letters, but I'll show you what I have out front. So like I said, I just pulled everything that I had. My old mat and um, my old welcome mats. The reef is new, of course but everything else is old. This was in our bedroom. I'm changing our bedroom. I'll get to that in a second. I'll tell you guys about that, but I'm completely taking everything out. But yeah, this is just what I have. So I'm just gonna work with it and see how it looks. All right, so I'm done that quick. This is how it came out. Um, Simple, cute, simple. The only thing I'm doing is adding a black lettered A to this reef. Um, I looked at Hobby Lobby and they have them. But this came from, um, what is it called? This came from Ikea. Well, the black vase came from at home. Yeah, at home. It was like 30 bucks, real cheap. The florals in it came from Ikea. What is this? Oh, I have this lamp. This, uh, what is this called? I, I have a brain fart. But um, I had this lamp forever, this black lamp. It came from Walmart. The little plant came from Big Lots. These two rugs came from Target, so yeah. I know this is plaid and the reef is straight, but who cares, it's still black and white. <laughs> but yeah, this is how it looks, y'all. Cute and simple. All right, guys, I am in the bedroom. My blinds are still open. It's nighttime, so I'm about to close them. It would be so freaking crazy if someone was like, ah. <laughs> This stuff I think about, child, let me see. Anyways, about to end the vlog. I hope you guys liked how my um, front patio came out. I'm so happy that I was able to like recycle some of the stuff that I, you know, used last year. Um, so I feel good. Like, you know what I mean? Like, when it comes to home decorating, like, I don't have that much to do this year because I did it all last year. Like, seriously, all year from January to December, I decorated the house. That's crazy. But I decorated the house and this year I'm done. Like I don't, I have like small pieces to get here and there. <clears throat> but for the most part, I don't have anything to get. Except this bedroom. So I told you guys I was going to give you an update on our bedroom. And I told you that I was taking everything out. And I am. I'm tired of our bed. Our bed is comfortable. It's huge. It's comfortable. But I hate it. <laughs> I hate the color. Um, I'm starting to really just hate the color. I hate that bench over there. I hate, I do not like this picture right here. I don't like the bench. I don't like our bed. I don't like anything. So our bedroom is pretty much empty anyways. Our bedroom and bathroom are plain. They're just plain, they're empty. And um, I told myself last year, I kept telling myself last year that I was going to decorate our bedroom and our bathroom. I'm actually very glad that I didn't decorate the bedroom because I would have regretted buying like all this stuff when I'm about to change it. So yeah, I'm just over the green. I feel like I stepped into the 70s every time I come in our bedroom. But the thing is, I don't have that much of it. <clears throat> so I'm selling our bed, I'm selling that bench and this painting right here this artwork and I'm starting over so we're starting over I've been looking at beds and I've been looking at what I want to get and I have a couple of them saved um I've been looking on Wayfair so yeah that's what I'm gonna do but I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog stay tuned for my luxury haul I keep saying that but for real stay tuned for my luxury ball come vlog haul what stay tuned for my luxury haul coming up this week. 
if you guys are not subscribed to my channel make sure you do subscribe and click the notification bell so you'll be alerted whenever i post a new video and i hope you guys enjoy your week ahead and i will see you guys in my next vlog bye even if you gotta leave somebody Call back, call back It's all good, it's all good